Hey folks, this is Vince with Dad's Gaming Addiction, and once again, we're going to play Mega Aquarium. We're going to play the second campaign level today, North Woods. So it looks like I've been tasked with refurbishing this old aquarium. It has several tanks, some decorations, and a couple of surviving fish. Alright, so it looks like we'll be using science points now to unlock new pieces of equipment. Alright, so let's take a look here. What do we got? Quite a mess, if you ask me. My goodness. Okay, um, well, we need to hire an employee for sure so we can continue feeding these things. Why we have... Hmm. We've got a, a lot of these item boxes. I mean, I guess we'll keep them there. This tank doesn't have... Okay, this is a combined filter. So we can, we, we're going to need another combined filter for this tank here. Let's see how much everything costs, because we only have $2,000. A lot less than what we had before. Okay, it's 40 bucks. I, I'm fine with that. Now, it says here that... Oh, okay, there's actually one in the corner. I didn't see that. Okay, so we're okay there. There's one there. This one... We might need... All right, we'll add another combined one here, and I'll take care of that. This one looks okay. All right, so we've got yellow tang here. Water quality required 60%, which we've taken care of. Oh, no one can get to this now. Maybe we should move this out of the way. Put that there. And this one... Alright. Let's go ahead and hire some staff. Alright, feeding and... Alright, this one looks the best, I think. We'll go ahead and hire you. Okay, so, looking around, I don't see a tool station anywhere. Let me take a look again. We've got a lot of feeders, but no tool station. And tool stations are needed to fix, you know, machinery as it breaks down, like this combined filter here. All right, so, yeah, 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 there we go. So I guess we'll put that, um... Mm. Yeah, that'll work. Makes sense. Alright, let's go ahead and open our aquarium. Oh, we have to complete objectives. Okay, on the right-hand side it says, Combined science across animals. Zero out of forty. Oh. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and add some benches too, real quick, while I'm thinking about it. I don't see any benches around here. Okay, so we're going to want to put these fish in here. Um, okay, we can put one in here. All right, now what's required for these fish? Okay, they eat orange pellets. That's fine. All right, I'm going to go ahead and add more. They provide science, which is good. Alright. And maybe some over here. Alright. Now let's go ahead and open. Good work. The aquarium is restocked and it's open to the public once more. You may have noticed that all the tanks at Northwoods are embedded into walls. They are called, unimaginatively, wall tanks. Wall tanks are viewed by guests from one side and accessed by staff via the other. This allows you to keep your equipment behind closed doors. Ah. Cool. I see that. So, they can view the tanks right here. Oh, well. This <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should move the tool dispenser then. Alright, let's go ahead and choose our next science project. I'm thinking 
the power com combination there. But yeah, let's go ahead and move this tool dispenser. We'll, we'll move it behind closed doors. I think that's better. There we go. Before, I just had all the tanks out in the open. Next, ecology project. Um, this one needs muscles, which I don't know if we have or not. This one needs green pellets, which I do believe... Yep, it's down there. So maybe we'll go with the flame angelfish. Now this says, uh, warning, may eat or damage stony corals, clams. All right, so we got to be careful about that. Dislikes conspecifics uh, cannot be housed with... Oh, so cannot be housed with flame angelfish? So it can't be housed. I don't get that. All right. Well, we'll go ahead and research it anyway. And we'll figure it out as we go. Well, it looks like we're quickly earning money down here. Slowly earning ecology and science. Once we get more customers... That'll speed right up. Our next objective is master the wall tank. We have to build a 3x3. Three three. Okay, so what we're going to do... Uh, this is decoration. I might put this here. And... How about... Oh, it gets in the way. How about here? <laughs> okay. Um, so I'm thinking... Wall tank... I wonder if these combine... Huh. Alright, let's demolish that. I wonder if I have to sp spread them out. Let's try that. Ball tank. Oh, yeah, have to click and hold. There we go. So we'll make a nice large one here. And we can put the... The combo here. It's not going to be enough, though. 18 out of 30. Do we want a heater instead? The power heater would work with it. I could put that right here. And because we put it back here, it's going to block the way. All right. Walls... I'm going to put that here. And that poor guy is trapped. Uh, let's go ahead and build a door. It's one of these buttons. There we go. Staff door. Uh, okay. What am I doing wrong? Invalid placement location. All right, let's demolish this wall. Oh, maybe I have to put... Maybe I have to leave a space and then build the door. That could be it. Yeah, 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 that's what we have to do. All right. Yeah, I'm not used to this. I'm, I'm just... I leave the tanks out in the open. We might need more staff. I'm going to go ahead and hire another staff member. Because we've got a lot of tanks, and everyone seems to be busy. Well, our one employee. We'll go ahead and hire you. That's fine. Actually, let's go ahead and hire another one. There we go. Now we've got three. Now, this one concerns me a bit. 53 out of 55. That might be because this thing needs to be repaired. And I might want to consider adding another tool station. Um, let's go ahead and add it back here. Because if one person's using the toolkit and something else needs to be repaired, our other employees can't do it. So having two tool stations might be a good idea. Oh, we need a tank 3x3. Three three. I don't think this is 3x3. Three three. Alright, let's demolish.
Okay, that's three by three. There we go. Very specific, these goals. Go ahead and put this wall here. And... Combo mini here. And I think... Plenty of heat. So what are we going to put here? Zebra Moray Eel? Um, four to nine. It does want caves, so I think... Ugh. It starts small, but will grow large over time. Grown-up animals are worth more points, but they will only grow if you fulfill all of their care requirements. Hover over the growth icon to find out how many days it takes to grow up. Alright, so we need caves here. The Driftwood Cave. There we go. Nicely done. The next stage of the Aquarian's expansion is down to you. Should be pretty simple. Oh, we need red pellets. Oh, or mussels. Yeah. Alright, let's get that. Muscle dispenser. We'll just throw that right here. And it looks like we're satisfying everything. I'm thinking maybe we can add another one. Uh, 60 insufficient water quality. I'm thinking about getting rid of this heater and adding the combo mini there instead. It does the same thing. Okay, now we need more... More caves. There we go. Now they're happy. Alright, let's check up on these other fish. Water quality of 55% needed. We've got 56%. Okay, so it's, it's doing pretty well here. We're fine. This one... Those are half and half Chromis. I'm going to butcher these fish names. Looks like they're fed pretty well. Water quality's looking good. Alright. That looks okay. Same thing over here. Water quality's looking good. Getting a lot of research. 67% water quality out of 60%. We're good. Heating element is good. Has plenty of, uh, well, plants. Over here. Everything looks fine here as well. Okay. So I'm thinking maybe we expand in this direction. Let's see how much money that would cost. Oh, it's not much. A hundred and yeah, I'm looking on the bottom of the screen there. Four hundred and fifty. Okay. Well, what we want to do, I think, is <laughs> let's get these walls built, so people just don't go exploring. There we go. And now we can add more rooms over here. Add more fish. All right. So the wall tank. All right, something like that, I guess. We're going to have a staff door, I think, right here. So let's block this off. Can we get this person out of here? I mean... Oh, okay, I can pick them up. You know what, I'm going to have to put the door first, because people just keep walking right in here. There we go. All 
All right, let's get the combo in here. The two of them. And I guess we have to figure out what fish we're going to put in here before we figure out what decorations to put in there. All right, the black bar soldier fish needs caves, dislikes lights, cannot be housed in a tank with tank light attachments. That's fine. All right, we'll go ahead and add uh, these guys. And we need a lot of caves. All right, good enough. Let's see what else we need. New animals unlocked. The flame angelfish. All right, let's go ahead and pick the next research. The coral grouper. Only one may be kept per tank. Oh, that's what that means. So it doesn't like others of its kind. Good to know. All right, I'm going to go ahead and put maybe some orange pellet dispensers in this area. Just the one. And another tool station, just to be on the safe side. Hmm. Okay, um, I want to get that flame angel fish. Maybe I'll go ahead and add a tank here. And it doesn't have to be too big either, because if, if there's only going to be one of them, then... I could do something like that, if there's only going to be one. I will add a wall here, and a door here. Only one. Okay, so it needs stuff. <laughs> yeah, needs lots of stuff. Um, first, I pause the game so the fish doesn't die on us. We're going to add some of these combo minis there. All right, that looks good. And we want some decorations. It looks like he wants some plants. Go ahead and add the eel grass. And it looks like it needs green pellets for food. We'll go ahead and put a dispenser in here. think we're good. All right, I'm going to go ahead and add uh, more benches. People seem to be tired. Everything's all crammed. All right, let's put one there. Don't say I don't give any place to sit down. All right, let's continue adding more tanks. All right, we'll put our wall. Ah, new combined filters unlocked. Let's go with the basic pump. All right, we'll put another tank maybe right here. We'll unlock more with our money. Let's go and get our staff door in here. All right, what's up with these X's? Does that mean the benches access is currently being blocked? All right, well, let's get rid of them then.
Okay. Um. The orchid dotty back. I guess we can add them. Actually, let's go with the king demisil, whatever how you would pronounce that. It gives me uh, more of these prestige points. All right. Um, let's go ahead and add equipment before I forget. This one's definitely better. What does this eight mean? Skill required. Fixing this will be time consuming for staff without some skill. All right, maybe we'll go ahead and put the regular ones in here, the minis. Why a sec, a third one? Because if I'm going to add more fish here, we need orange pellets. And I'm going to add some decoration anyway. It doesn't look like they need any, but couldn't hurt. Some rubble. And it looks like we get fame points for this too, so it doesn't hurt to add stuff. Even if they don't need it. Maybe I should do that to the other tanks as well. Like some small rocks, for example. Maybe a sea lettuce. New animals unlocked, the coral grouper. It has a couple of K requirements you haven't seen before. They are greedy, which means they eat more and lower water quality more than other animals. I can only keep... One may be kept per tank. All right. They may eat fish and crustaceans, which are smaller than itself. Okay. We'll put them down in a minute. Let's go ahead and add more stuff. This will increase our fame points. Whoever's looking at these things. It's a lot of rocks, I know, but... Okay. That should improve our prestige on the top there. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and unlock some more space here. Actually, let's just... Uh, that's good. All right, only one per tank. So I think, oh, there we go. Impressive work on the latest expansion. It's time to learn about pumps. Pumps allow you to remotely locate your equipment away from your tanks. Instead of attaching your heaters, filters directly to the tank, you attach them to the pump, which is several tiles away. Ah, okay. Cool. I don't know if we need to do that this time, but... A lagoon tank? Similar to the basic tank, but is sunken into the floor, increasing its capacity. Uh, well, let's stick to the wall tanks for right now. Oh, it doesn't look like we actually have to, because it says build a tank with type... Okay, so let's redo. Uh, it looks like part of our objective is to do this, so we'll go ahead and do that. Lagoon tank. All right, there's our lagoon tank. Yeah, notice how it's deeper down in there. A pump at least three tiles away. All right, so let's go ahead and put the combos maybe over here actually let's put the, t the pump down first we'll see how this works oh we didn't unlock the pump yet i guess we're still researching it so we're gonna we're gonna wait for that sufficient water quality sufficient heating 
Okay. So basically the objective is get the pump up and running and say to the fish. I guess we can decorate it. Put some rubble in here. And maybe some driftwood cave and some sea lettuce. And it looks like we still earn fame, even though there's no fish in here. If they look at the tank and see stuff inside here, we still earn a little bit of that fame, which is interesting. Oh, the zebra marais has grown. In addition, zebra marais eel can now eat tank mates up to size three, so be careful. Well, that's not good. Um, okay, let's go ahead and choose now. Uh, we need to do something about this water quality. Let's go ahead and address that. Hopefully these two don't eat each other. Alright, there's our basic pump. We'll put that... I just Let's go ahead and put that maybe here. Connect it to that. And let's go ahead and add this. Cool. That's neat. And we'll add the the one that we just unlocked. What was that? The Coral Grouper. One of your guests is thirsty. Build some vending machines so they have somewhere to purchase a drink. Alright, we'll do that in a minute. Let's get these red muscle dispensers out. Okay. Oh, I have to build three vending machines. Okay. People are very thirsty. Reach rank four. Should be pretty easy. I'm just going to fast forward time now. Let's go ahead and zoom out, make sure everything's good to go. One of your guests has thrown their fizzy drink litter on the ground. Build a broom stand. It's a new station. I guess we'll add it over here. Actually, let's go ahead and add a couple. You can reduce the amount of time your staff spend sweeping by placing bins around your aquarium. I figured that. Alright. Bin. There. Alright, three should be enough for right now. Oh, we've got a trapped guest over here, I guess. I'm thinking maybe we should hire more employees. Feeding and fixing, feeding and fixing, and this one can fix. All right, I don't think we need that one. Okay, um, I'm thinking maybe some more fish tanks at this point, just because we're, we seem to be hovering around 155-ish. So let's add this. Let's just unlock all of this. And we want to add walls here. Also here. Let's 
Let's go ahead and put the lagoon tank in here. Okay. And a staff door. I love how easy this game is. I mean, I'm sure because it's only the second level, it's actually manageable. I'm guessing later down the line, we're going to have a lot more to worry about. All right, let's decide on fish first. Um, we don't need to level up our research or ecology right now. So let's just focus on things that will get us the most fame points. Um, it looks like the... Okay, the, we could build another coral grouper here. We'll just put another one in here. Um, it needs equipment. Combo mini. There we go. Needs caves. Add another one for good measure. And sea lettuce. All right, let's continue that trend, shall we? Actually, no, what? Let's do this. Stupid people. All right, we'll just demolish um, these walls here. And they can access this tank by walking in that door. Makes it easier. That doesn't look right, though. Like, this is... Yeah, I'm thinking maybe... You know what, let's just make this an open area, because the lagoon tanks you look down on, I mean, like, I just, this just, it's just, without the wall here, it just looks really strange. Like, you can still see the employees back here doing stuff, so what's the point? So, let's just, let's just keep this open. And we'll move everything. Can we move this? I think. Rank up! Awesome. Newly unlocked kelp and rocky overhang. Available to research. We've got a lot more fish now. Crabs and more. Congratulations on reaching rank 4. Among the new animals you can unlock at this rank are the first crustaceans. The blue knuckle hermit crab is a great support animal because it doesn't need feeding and actually provides additional filtering. You now have your final objective. Alright, let's go ahead and go for the... Again, we want fame, so let's go with this longhorn cro uh, cowfish. Sure. And we'll go ahead and go after the large filter. I'd like to move that, actually, right there. And we need to move that. Actually, we'll just put this like so. Get these tanks ready. Ooh, the rocky overhang. It it takes care of uh, rock need and cave systems. So we'll go ahead and put that in here. Got some messages. Interested in some decorations? Ah, oh, we got more decorations. If you want it, just let me know. Objective requirements. Build a tank with a conch, barrel, anchor, and shell. 
Oh, we could try it. Um, so let's do this. We'll put another one. We'll build a large one here. And these decorations, let's find them. What's kelp do? Deep tank only. Can only fit in deep tanks. Ah, cool. Okay, so for this objective... Sure, I'll take it off your hands. Okay. So now we have to complete this objective. That's cool. So even though it like apparently you can get side objectives from your message logs. So I was I was ignoring this completely. So um, you may want to check on these from time to time because it looks like there's actually a reason to take a look at this message log besides the information part of it. You can actually get side quests. All right. Um, so where is this conch located? Can we You'd think it would be here. Hmm. So where are these things at? Where's the barrel? Where's the anchor? Where's the shell? Where do I find these things? Here you go. Oh, okay. I have to click on them. You can only carry one object at a time. Oh, okay. So put one there. We take them out of our message. Okay. There's plenty more where that came from. You'll find it all in a decoration section of the build menu. Okay. Okay. So yeah, definitely check on these messages from time to time. Tropical beach paint. Conch. Yeah, it looks like we get fame. Well, I, I call it fame. It's prestige, but same thing. Um... Guess some kelp. There we go. Crabs and more. All right, so our objective, uh, we're up to 220. So all we need to do now is just get more uh, more fish unlocked here, which we're on our way to do. Our ecology and research are going up nicely. I do have it on fast forward, so it normally it wouldn't take this long. All right, pick next research. Well, what I meant to say was it's going by very quickly because I have it on fast forward, but normally it would take a lot longer than this. I think I said that backward. Anyway, um... Fish. Again, I want something with a lot of prestige points. Do I want to add these to one of these tanks? I, I, I guess. I think the game actually tells you how many you have already. Like, I don't have any of these Orchid, Dotty Backs, or Azure. If you look underneath the fish, it says times five. Yep, you currently have five in your aquarium. Let's pick fish that I don't have, just, just to... Like, we can put these here, and we'll put these over here. We're going to need, uh, yeah, we need to put, there we go. New animals unlocked, the longhorn cowfish. We'll go with the Blue Knuckle Hermit Crab. You've just unlocked your first armored animal. 
Armored animals count as twice the size when determining whether they can be eaten by a predator. This makes them excellent tank mates for your fish and crustacean eating animals. Okay. Eh, that's good. Alright, so these guys... Wow, they have 5 prestige. May eat or damage starfish. They eat cockles. Alright, well, note to self. Um, let's get this tank... Uh, I need better quality than that. Alright, good. And we need to put down the appropriate food. There we go. Put some decorations. Uh, put some shells in here. Looks like people are a little thirsty. I'm going to go ahead and put um, a vending machine here and perhaps a bin or two. Looks like our aquarium is growing nicely. I don't see any issues up this way. Although it looks like there's a lot of feeding requests. Maybe we might need to hire more staff. We've got $15,000. Uh, unfortunately, this one can only fix. Doesn't have the feeding skill. We'll go ahead and hire them anyway. That way, this one can maybe fix stuff while everyone else does the feeding. In my head, that, that makes sense. New heaters unlocked. Take it. New animals unlocked. The blue knuckle hermit crab. Scavenger does not contribute to bioload of tank, automatically fed when any other animal in the tank is fed. Crustacean, avoid placing with tank mates, which are dangerous to crustaceans. Alright, we'll go ahead and research the fox face rabbit fish. Alright, so maybe we'll put the... Put these here. We need to take care of the tank though first. I'm going to add more. Yeah, I know. What I could probably do is build a wall here, build the pump. I just, I don't feel like doing it. Uh, <laughs> and uh, let's go ahead and add some kelp. And we'll figure out what else to add once we unlock our next fish. It looks like, though, that we actually lose prestige when they look at these things here. So maybe it, it makes sense to put them behind closed doors. It doesn't matter because we've won this scenario. Okay, um, you've accomplished a lot here at North Woods. Another job offer has come in. All right, let's go ahead and take the job at Elmshorn. And in the next video, maybe we'll tackle that. If you guys haven't already, subscribe to my channel and check out my official website, www.dadsgamingaddiction.com. This is Vince. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.